Hey guys, Jess from Knockout Print Shop, and today we're gonna do a somewhat real plan with me. As you know, I've been releasing kind of more like reverse plan with me, it's just where I flip through um, my month worth of spreads, but I wanted to kind of do an actual plan with me. So right now I'm doing what I call planning light over the summer because I have a lot less going on in the summer. The shop is less busy. We try to get things done as quickly as possible so that we can like get outside and enjoy the summer. So this is my planning light process. I actually wrote a blog about it, so I'll um, share the link to that below as well. But I wanted to kind of have you go through that process with me. And let me start off by showing you last week. So basically what I did was I took our vertical um, half sheet insert, that's the to-do list, and just wrote this like running to-do list all week long and checked things off as I went. Like as soon as I thought a new thing, wrote it down, wrote it down. This was just easier for me than going through each day and kind of trying to put my to-dos in each day and organizing things. I was just like, I need to get things done. Let me not forget anything and brain dump on this page and then mark it off. And then what I would do a day or so later was go back in and add stickers to each day things were done and icons and things like that. So um, this was more of like a creative fun part where I just kind of went back and did stickers and stuff like that, as well as a way for me to easily reference when things um, were completed. So if I'm flipping back through my planner, I want to be like, oh, when did we do X or did I do this? Having the stickers and kind of this whole more creative spread is easier from a reference standpoint than trying to find things on just like a massive to-do list. So we're going to do the fun stickering part together. So right now, all I have is just some headers down and some mini hexes that I did not put on very good that keep coming off. And um, my massively messy half sheet, vertical half sheet um, grid paper insert. So I use this and just, again, wrote like a massive to-do list and was checking things off. I did put like really quickly the days that I got these tasks done. So when I'm going back, and putting these things in, it would be easier. Last week I didn't have to do that because I would kind of like fill in the day, the previous day on that day. So like Tuesday I would go in and put the stickers for Monday and so so forth. This week I was just like not about dealing with my planner. So this was my planner. So this is gonna be planning light. And I think, we'll see how this goes. Hopefully this video is not too long. Since I haven't done this kind of video before, this could be a cluster, we'll see. Okay, so the only things I do have down every week when I'm planning light is my sidebar here with my little goal section. So basically what I do is I take our, um, I have like one of these stickers on here, our goal mini hexes. This is um, IWP-T242. And I just take one from each color, put it down here in the sidebar, and then write the coordinating categories, like P is for personal, S is for social. I've been doing that last month as well, but even though I'm not planning my spreads ahead of time, I'm still doing this because I can just kind of quickly, this my planner lays on my desk, I can quickly see this and go, okay, you still haven't done this, you still haven't done this, you need to make time to do that. So we have that. Okay, so let's try to get started. And then I have like headers down and that's it in my little good stuff section. So I do have my priority header, my to-do header, my weekend banner, and my little highlight good stuff thing with the grid sidebar in here. So that's the only things I have down. So with my priority um, section, it's always one task because actually the word priority means one thing. We have kind of destroyed it as Americans to make the word mean more than one thing, we say priorities, but priority is actually one thing. So I pick one thing that above all else has to get done that day and make sure that gets done. So Monday, Wednesday, Friday is always fill order days. So I just go ahead and put that in here. I should probably make myself a sticker that says this, but I don't know about you guys, sometimes I just like writing things and I like writing on this paper. Um, Tuesday is always like our design day, and Thursday is pretty much especially in the summer and no work day, so I always put relax. I don't even like to put day off because I just like to put that it's important to relax. So that's what we have first, and this thing's gonna have to be sideways for me to do that. I'll turn it the normal way at the end. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kind of reference this massive list here. So this was Monday. Monday's like my busiest day of the week, it's like, get as much as you can do, get done, so you have to do less the next week. So let's see if I can quickly, with you guys, go through this and make it so this doesn't take forever. So it looks like in here, like I had a lot of emails. So I think what I'm gonna do, and I have like no organization right now with my sticker situation. Um, oh my God, 
experience or mess. So I think what I need to do here for all these emails that I have is I just need, if I have it, I didn't even like check to see if I have all the stock of the stickers that I need. So this could be, this is why I don't do plan with me's you guys, because I kind of suck at plan with me's. Okay. So I'm going to take this little envelope guy and put him down to indicate emails and try to go through and write down who I needed to email. So I'm just going to write email and then put the people's names down and then just kind of mark them off as I go. So these are like, some of these are probably business related. Some of these are, um, what do you call it? Personal and I used to just write do emails, but I realized like I needed to actually keep a list of who I needed to email or I would just like screw things up. Okay. So that's all the emails that I can see. Um, okay. So that takes care of that. And I think, okay, of course I don't have a ruler. We're going to use, we're going to use this sheet, this jacked up sheet as a ruler. So since I am making a list, I'm going to kind of box this list in here. I love boxes. And I should have grabbed some outlined or new outline boxes, but this will work. Okay. So that's kind of like my email section. doesn't have to be beautiful, but it works. Okay. So there's that. Then it looks like, I think also on here, I had some text messages to send. So what I'm going to do next is take a little text, a text message icon. This is a smartphone icon and I'm going to put this down here and put text slash call and let's see let's see so i had to text maggie so this is again a mix of personal and um work related just so that i get it all in one place i should probably i don't know if i'll do this but i should probably like speed through this so you guys aren't bored to tears by this whole process of me just writing down people i needed to call or text um okay i think that's it so we'll go here with that so these are the tasks that have to get done or get done in addition to our main task which is fill orders Matt and I kind of like divide and conquer. Some days if he's working on designing new listings and some stuff like that, then I'll be in charge of filling orders. If I have more content related stuff, he'll be in charge of filling orders if I do stuff like that. So it kind of, we go back and forth. So I'm going to just check these off because obviously I already did them. Sometimes I just use check. Sometimes I use a stencil to make a little box. Okay, so we have that. Let's see what other projects that I have to do. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, so it looks like we need some kind of dollar sign thing. So I think what I'm going to use is this guy as a reminder that I needed to pay myself. Or should we put this in the bottom? Hmm. Let's see. How did I do this last week? Okay. Um, money. So, you know what? We'll do a money section. So we're just going to put this down. This is going to end up. This is one of the reasons I actually stopped using my planner to make lists because I ended up some days being like so long of lists and then some days having nothing. So let's try to consolidate this. So I need to do, um, oh my gosh, this again, guys, this is why I don't do plan with me because you're probably ready to like go to sleep now watching my process. Okay. So I need to do, I need to pay myself. So since we're small business owners, we just pay ourselves. I need to pay our Amex bill. Uh, so let's pay Amex, pay myself. I think on Tuesday we paid NC sales tax. That's the last time with that because we are no longer in NC. Um, and then I needed to sell my shares of my Vanguard. I think that's what I did. I know I, I bought shares too. I don't know what the heck day that happened. Okay, we're gonna take that off. I have a feeling this video is gonna be really long, you guys. I may have to like fast forward through this so that you're not bored to tears and just show you part of this process because this is already 10 minutes in and we're only on Monday. I guess the good thing is the rest of the week gets fairly light because like I said, Monday is like super day. Okay, so that takes care of those things. Um, 
let me see. Then I'm going to use... Maybe I'll use the computer guy for the rest of this, the rest of the stuff because it's all like computer related. So I'm just going to put, um, so I had a blog post, blog email. I had IG post, Instagram post, and work on the flows. I'm going to say email flows. Because this is like a consolidated version of basically what actually happened in real life. So we're just going to leave that like that for now so I don't bore you guys. So I got send out blog post, email, work on flows, um, Instagram posts, and there's a few things here I didn't do that were more personal. So what I'll do is this is kind of like my bottom section is usually my personal section. So this is going to be, I had to like back up my phone and get all the pictures off it. So I'll put that here, and then, okay, that's that. Um, and then renew my library book. I don't even know if I have a book sticker here. Let's, we'll just use this. I knew I have a, we have the books due library sticker, but I don't have that on me. So we're gonna say renew library book. It feels so weird doing a plan with me since I haven't done this in like, forever. So that's what Monday looks like. We'll leave this open. Tuesday, so let me go into Tuesday and see what's going on. So we had a few business things to do. So we definitely filled orders, did design, filled orders. Okay. So basically Tuesday we use for designing stickers, kind of admin meetings, things like that. So what I think I'm going to do there is I'm going to use one of these cute post-it note guys. I'll use this one. Put that here because I can fill up more space. And I'm going to say decide because sometimes I just need to make like decisions. So I need like a decide to do list. And this was on new listings that we're going to make for the rest of the month and if we're going to have any sales. So that's how we decide that. So those two things are kind of like done. And then I had to buy some stuff. I need like a to buy sticker. I know we used to have those, but they didn't sell too good. So we don't have that as a header anymore, but I might have a blank header in here. Probably not, cause I need one. Oh wait, I can use this. So here we go, we'll try this. We're gonna use a little checklist. Mm, we'll put it here and I'm just gonna write in my own handwriting to buy. And then it was, what did I buy? Uh, we had to buy a fly trap because we leave our patio door open because it's awesome and it gets flies everywhere. And then we had to buy dish soap. And I feel like there was something else that I didn't buy that I should have. So we got that there, got that there. Okay, so those are good as far as that goes. And then, I did have like a text and an email that we had to get back to. So I'm going to do this again here with the little guy. So I'm gonna, and it was just one person. So you can see like by Tuesday already, we've like dramatically reduced the amount of things we have to do. And then I had to text my client, Anna. So that's that. So sometimes these lists are bigger and sometimes they're smaller. So we got this and we got this. Um, this still did not get done. So I need to kind of like star the things I haven't done yet. Okay. Where are we at? Oh my God, we're at 14 minutes. Okay. So Wednesday is another order day and then a few random things that this is a lot of this is more personal kind of stuff. So let's see. First thing I had to do, I'm going to use the phone icon, like the regular phone instead of the cell phone and put, I need to call UPS or USPS. Unfortunately, sometimes we have to deal with them. I'm going to use the little phone icon. I had to text one of my friends from back home in Chicago. 
If I don't write this stuff down anymore about who to call and contact, I never do it. So call UPS, text Allison. Okay, the other thing I needed to do was, this was a more personal thing again, so I think I'm gonna put it down here, was I took a kayak lesson, Matt and I did, and um, Matt's a photographer, so he took some fun pictures of us kayaking. So I wanted to put those pictures in the local kayaking group to give the lady that gave us the lesson a shout out, so I'm gonna put that down here. Post kayak pictures. Okay, there's that. And email Michelle. Okay, how do you guys keep track of emails? Do you use these little icons like this? Do you have just like a running email list? I think that keeping a list lately like this is helping me. Um, and I'm sure I'll like smooth this system out as I go. Like maybe I'll have sections to this list, like an email section, a buy section. But right now I'm just like brain dumping because I can't seem to hold a lot of information in my brain at this point. Um, okay, so let's use the computer again. You can see even like when you're planning light, you don't need a ton of stickers. Like just go for your go-to stickers and make them work for multiple purposes. I think sometimes it can be like, oh my God, I need a sticker that's specific to every single thing I do. And I don't think you always need that. I think sometimes you can just make stickers work so it makes your process easier. Um, okay, so I needed to print our training logs and I also needed to, let's see, um, deal with our email server code. So Clavio code. Sometimes I just can just put different little parts of to do's there and I'll remember. Okay, so I'm not putting boxes around this now because I don't need to bore you guys with that. Okay, so that was, oh, and then we went to REI. So I'm gonna put, I'll use another one of these. So we are like back on this kick of wanting to do like camping or van life. Um, so we've been researching like different gear and things like that to start to be able to travel more. So this was a fail though. We went to REI and I was like, everything here is too expensive and there's not a good selection. We just need to go on Amazon. Um, okay. So then Thursday, oh, you know what? I totally forgot here is I went on a friend date with my friend Maggie and we went to a new plant store. So let me see here. I think I'm gonna use one of these. I'll use this or should I use this one? This is from our spring kit, but Hey, it works because it has a plant. Oh shit! It has a plant on it. Okay, plant date with Maggie. I love plants. Who else loves plants? Do you go on plant friend dates? That was at three thirty. That works. That looks okay. I don't love how it looks, but that's fine. Okay, so we did that. Did that. Okay, so Thursday, basically, Matt and I went to. That was yesterday. Um, we went to a couple waterfalls because that's like our new jam is like chasing waterfalls all over middle tennessee so we went to manchester tennessee and we saw the rutledge falls and the machine branch falls in um short springs natural area so we love doing that so i'm gonna put my little hiker girl and we like went and we like brought our camping grill and found like a picnic shelter and like had our breakfast lunch and then we hiked and Matt took pictures of waterfalls and it was fun. So this was picnic plus hiking plus waterfalls. So that was fun. I love to be outside as much as we can in the summer. So I'm just going to put hashtag Manchester. So if I'm looking back at this, I will remember where we went that day. Okay. That's that. And then we didn't work the rest of that day. Okay. And then let's see. So then we get to Friday, which is today. Matt's filling orders while I'm finishing this here. So obviously I needed to film a video. So we're gonna use this guy, the little film video guy. Oh my God, we're almost at 20 minutes. This is why you guys, I don't do plan with me anymore. I can't say that enough. If this is too long, let me know and I will never do this again. Um, so film videos, got that, okay. I still have some things on here that are not done, so I'm just gonna again star those. Um, this to buy list is like in progress. And let's see, I also needed to, this is another video related task. I needed to watch my coaching client, watch Anna's videos. 
So I do that every Friday and send her feedback. So I got that. Um, I did need to send one of my the customers, Melinda, an email with some information. Email Melinda. Friday's a little bit lighter of a day unless I use it to make content like this, so we don't have as much going on either. Oh, and then I need to email Angela. So we'll just make a list here. Okay. And then we do have a few, so I'm not using, this totally is planning light, you guys. I have barely any stickers on this thing. So I'm going to use another one of the hexagon dollars to remind myself to pay our water bill. So since we moved to Gallatin, it's a little um, smaller town. You know, things are a little slower here in Tennessee. And we're used to having like everything be online and it's like free to bill pay online. A lot of things out here if you try to pay online, they charge you a convenience fee. And I am like frugal Jess and will not pay convenience fees, which makes bill paying a little bit more confusing for us or tedious because now we have to like write checks and mail checks. And we used to just pay everything the first of the month and know it, go in there online. But you know, it is what it is. So there's that. Um, and then I got the film video thing. And then let's see, I did deal with the Clavia issue. So maybe I'll use what do I want to use here? Maybe just for changing it up, I'm going to use this just to make it a little different. I'm just going to use this. Clavio is our email provider and we're just having some issues. So like contact. Yep. That'll, that looks fabulous. And I know what that means. Okay. So that's what we're using. That's not very helpful. Okay. And then I needed to, I have a thing, Luke Combs concert's coming to Nashville and I needed to be on the like verified buyer Ticketmaster thing so we could get first dibs. I don't think I have, we have that cool little ticket sticker or, that's like the blank ticket. I don't think I have that sitting here with me. So I think I'm gonna have to do that guy later. Um, let's see, so this weekend, let me make a list since we don't, usually weekends are pretty chill for us. So I don't have much going on. But I can make a list a little bit of that. The other thing is that's like mandatory for me are these right now because I just haven't been wanting to deal with having extra inserts and stuff like with the daily docket, which I love, but I'm like planning light lazy planner right now. So this is a little easier. So basically in here I put my daily tasks. So um, my tasks are right now wake up by 6 a.m. I drink water first thing in the morning. That's another important one that I do. Uh, what else? Oh, I'm doing this thing right now. I'll talk about it in another video about breathing at meals. It's very weird. I know it sounds weird, but I'll explain that another time. Um, bah, 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 bah. The other thing is bed, but I'm going to go kind of backwards. I just bought a bullet journal. I'm doing this in a bullet journal. This is a lot easier. Bed by 10. Uh, read is the other one here. I wear blue blockers at night. Probably should talk about that in another video <laughs> by 8 p.m. Um, journal. So you get the idea. Oh, and then it's like my my day tasks, like my admin task, email, social, and um, uh, check accounts. So every day, like to start the our business day, I always go through check all emails and convos and then I go through and check all social and respond there, go through all our accounting stuff and then it's like boom, get into the rest of the day. Um, so that is kind of like my routine list, I guess you would say. So there's that. Okay, this will end up being just my highlights section that I'll fill out later. I'll put, in, oh, I can put it now. I will say plant friend date with Maggie. This is helpful like when I'm going through my uh, reflection to see this really quickly so I can remember the highlights of my weeks. Um, and then I'm going to say our picnic and hike. And who knows what will happen this weekend, so we'll leave room. Okay, then I don't know if I want to put this buy list anywhere. I'm not a huge putting lists of things I need to buy. Okay, so that is pretty much it, guys. I'm going to stop there because this is video is like 25 minutes long. So let me know what you guys think about this video. If this is too long to kind of see this full process, I'm happy to just do a flip through and kind of explain the process in reverse. Um, I didn't really, again, go too much down here into the daily boxes. I think off camera I'll do that. 
and figure out how I want to use that. But I wanted to kind of give you guys a live version of what my planning light is. So basically it's a to-do list and then later on going back in and putting stickers and filling out my weekly spread because this is easy to just keep going with my brain dump of things to do and it just makes my life a little bit easier right now. So long story short, this is a long video. Let me know your thoughts and I will see you guys in the next one.